What's up? This is Donovan Green from DonovanGreenFitness.com. Today we're going to do a total body workout. You are going to need to have your dumbbells. I'm using, I'm using nine pounders and I'm using five pounders. The sequence is going to be 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. You will get some advanced movements. If you're not able to do the standard stuff, you're going to see a little, little icon, a little box that's going to show you modified how to use the same movements or similar movements from the chair. All right, so grab your dumbbells. Let's get our bodies, get ready to work. We are going to drive. It's going to be 10 minutes. Like I said, 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. So don't tell nobody I don't love you. First one. Arm curl to shoulder press. We're going to start off in 10 seconds. Take a deep breath. Time is going to go off in 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's go. So arm curls. I'm turning here. One. Press. Keep the knees soft. Make sure you're not locking out those knees. Keep your chest lifted. Your stomach is nice and tight. Drive up to that ceiling, focus on that exhale. There it is, we're looking good. Keep the focus high, keep the focus strong. Listen to the body, you're gonna feel the muscles warming up and time, good job. Take the 15 seconds. Next one is gonna be your bent over rows. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hinge from the hips, keeping the butt nice and high, bringing the chest towards the floor, and I'm gonna roll up, back down, all right? Ready, let's go. So pull up. I'm tracing the side of the thighs, right? So I'm not coming out here like this. I'm tracing right up the side of that thigh, and I'm squeezing the shoulder blades together. A little pause in the top, so don't rush the movement. Beautiful. Feel that squeeze. Pinch the shoulders together. There you go. Aim to use the lat muscles right here to do the pulling and not your biceps. The biceps are right here, okay? And time. Look at that. 45 seconds goes by really fast. The next move coming up is your high knee to your front raises. I'm here. I'm going to lift up. One. Up. Front. Okay? Palms facing down to the ground. Let's go. Knee. Knee. One. Remember, every time you land, land with a soft knee. Don't land stiff-legged. Keep the tension on the muscle and not the joints. When you, when you have your legs too straight, you're putting too much pressure on what? The joints. So this exercise is working a lot of different fibers through your lower abs, your thighs, your front shoulders, which is your front deltoids. It's working a lot of muscles, plus some stabilizers, which means your oblique muscles are activating a bit as well. That's the side of your stomach. And relax. Whew. 45 seconds over by real fast. Next one coming up is your squats, usual squats. You're going to hold the dumbbell right here and drive the butt down and up and squeeze and clinch the glutes, okay? Here we go. Take your time. Now go as low as you can. Find a stance that works good for you. I tend to stand a little wider with my toes out a bit because that helps me to bypass my injuries. I work around those injuries and I get to still do a squat. Every time you come up to the top, clinch the glutes, squeeze the butt muscles nice and tight. So if I was to come and smack you in your butt, I should break my hands. That's how tight I want your abs to be and your butt. Not your abs, well your abs too, but your booty. Squeeze the booty. Beautiful. Shake it off. Next one is going to be your side raises with your side raises. So I'm going to go from one going up. We're going to go for only one side in this round, okay? And then we'll do the other side in the last round. Here we go. Find your balance. I'm not touching the ground 
with that step, with the leg that's lifting up. I'm staying only on the supporting leg the whole time. Keep the core nice and tight. Pace yourself. Remember, don't worry about my, my pace. If I'm going too fast for you, feel free to pick the speed down. <laughs> if I'm going too slow for you, feel free to pick the speed up. You're picking either way. Come on. Take your time. Pull that navel into that spine. Stabilize those abs. Good. Shake it off. That's the full set. Now we're going to go back to the top. Arm curl to presses. The time is going to go off in about five seconds. Catch your breath. Four, three, two, one. Let's go. Curl, turn, press. Now keep your elbows really tight to your body, right? Give me that full stretch on the top and right here in the bottom. Full stretch. Stay engaged, baby. Stay engaged. Woo! There it is. Now, I know your stomach muscles can be tighter than that, so make it tighter. Come on, suck it in some more. Including myself, I had to make my stomach a little tighter as well. There's always room to make it tighter. Beautiful. And time. Nice work. Bend over rows coming up. Remember the position, right? I'm going to turn this way now. You get to see different angles. The time is going to go off in five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Remember, drag it up by the side of that thigh. That's going to protect your back in the long run. Keep that core tight. You get to that bottom, give me your stretch. Don't rush. Focus on that muscle. Feel the contraction. Mind-body connection. Connect your body and your mind together so you can feel the muscles that's working. It doesn't matter if you have nine pounds or if you have 90 pounds. Whew. Right now I have nine pounds and they feel like 90s. Whew. Why? Because I'm squeezing. There you go. And time. Oh, I'm so happy that one is done. Next one coming up. High knees to your front raises. First round, we went a little slower. This round, I want you to go a little faster. Here we go. Three, two, one. We're going to combine it together, okay? Before, we had it separate. But now, we're bringing those knees up, one after the next. Whew. It's going to bring the heart rate up some more. Whew. Every time I come up, the palms are facing down to the ground. Whew. You see it? Little twist. Whew. Come on, keep it going. Whew. Come on, stay strong here with me. You're almost there. You have eight seconds left. Don't stop now. Too late to stop. Five seconds. Four, three, two, time. Oh, yeah. Whew, that got the heart rate up. We're going into those squats next, okay? We're gonna play around with these squats. We're gonna do quarters right here, one here and up. You ready? Let's go. Good. So you're pulsing it. Pulse up and squeeze. Don't forget to breathe. You can hear me exhaling, right? That's why I want you to know. Breathe. A lot of oxygen to move through your system. Whew. That's how you get stronger. Keep on going. We have 10 seconds. You can do this. Whew. Three seconds. Whew. And time. Nice work. Last thing coming up. Woo, the heart rate is up and I love it. Side raises, okay, remember. Remember the leg you did the first time. I did my left, now I have to do my right. Here we go, three, two, one, let's go. Whew. Whew. 
That's it. Stay proud here. If you lose your balance, it's okay. If you lose your balance, just get right back into motion again. That's how you know you're working your balance. Right now, I just lost my balance. See? I get back into it again. Just don't get frustrated. Come on, we're almost home. A few more seconds. Put a smile on your face. Woo, that's it. Activity is completed. Yes, so I did not have to go with my lighter weights today. The nine pounds was perfect. When you're training your body, remember, train your body to be better every day. Don't train your body to be broken down. And don't tell yourself that you cannot. I don't care if you're in the chair or if you're standing up. There's a way to get your body going. There's a way to burn those calories. Like right now, I burned a lot of calories, and I feel great. Do me a favor. Head on over to DonovanGreenFitness.com. Consider supporting the program because I want to keep on giving you guys a lot. I'm revamping everything. I'm bringing you guys a whole list of energy. I'm bringing you a whole ton of things that you're going to absolutely love with your fitness. And I'm going to cater to all levels. So you're going to get to see the videos and you're going to get to see the graphics and all the different things that's going to help you along the way. And we're about to start our online coaching. So if you need some online coaching, feel free to email me at getfit at donovangreenfitness.com. You can do a one-time offer or you can choose to work with me every month. It's up to you. All right. Love you. Don't forget your body's just a body until you make it a temple. And what am I doing? I am destroying your excuses. So you have no more excuses whatsoever. Leave a comment, subscribe, and help me by sharing the video. Pass it on. Later.